CLs, what's up? It's your boy C Option. I'm back with another video, right? And uh this video, right? Um I said right already twice in the first few seconds of this video. Great start. Um yeah, choose to be around those who you who fit your future. So what do I mean by this? Y'all ever hear this saying, if you have five friends that are lazy, there's a chance you'll be the sixth one that's lazy. Or if you have five friends that are working, there's a chance you'll be the sixth one that's working. It's all about who you surround yourself around. I'm not even talking about family. I'm talking about those who you constantly talk to in a social manner or those who you link up with on the weekdays and or weekends. The environment affects the growth of the child is what my dad always said to me growing up let alone a conversation we'd remind one another in these recent years. Be mindful of those who you talk with, let alone what it is that y'all are talking about. Ask yourself, is what we're talking about something that puts money in our pocket, or is it something that is is it or is it something that's closely related to gossip? Make sure it's something of value, even if it's not something that puts immediate funds in your pockets. It could be conversations that elevate your mindset, let alone one another's. Time is something that is proven time and time again that is never regained. If what you are doing right now with those who you surround yourself around isn't progressing for the better, you still have right now after this video, let alone tomorrow, to really come to your senses to do better. Lastly, when reflecting on those who you surround yourself around, reflect on whether those you currently talk to and spend time with are ones who you find yourself living in the past with when conversing and or getting together with. That's like a clear sign of something that you might wanna stay away from because you wanna be around those who are living in the present, affirming a foundation daily for the future. And uh, what do I mean by talking, like talking in the past with, so like you ever have those friends, right? Or you, like people you just link up with, but every time you guys like link up with, even if it's not like current, like repetitively, like monthly, just like once in a while, still like, this is still your time that you're, you're using, you know? But what do I mean by this? Like, it could be the people that you hang out with all the time, but like, do you ever, like, catch yourself reminiscing about things, but always reminiscing about the same thing? Like, it's not something new. Like, you'd be like, oh, Jerry, remember this? Or Jerry hits you up and be like, remember this? But it's, like, something repeated. Like, that's what I mean by, like, like staying in the past or talking about the past with. Because, like, you're staying in the past still. You're not really, like, forming new memories. Like, are, is this, this, like, ask yourself this, like, when you catch yourself talking about the same thing. Is there something new that you guys like reminisce about? Is there something that you created a new memory off of? And now like in the next month or so, you can also just like reflect and see then, is this something that we talk about? Like, is there something new? Like, are we creating new memories or are we just living in the past? That's basically what I mean. Like, are you just talking about the same thing over and over? And it's like, not something that you like purposely do, right? But it's just like, I, I feel like we've all, we all had like experiences with one another, like with our friends or our old friends or whoever, whoever we used to like hang out with, we like, or even right now, but basically what I mean by it is like, there's things that we like talk about and it's just the same topic. It doesn't even have to be the same specific thing, but it, it's just a topic that really isn't progressing. It's not elevating our mindset. It's just like really a waste of time. It's just like busy talk, right? Like busy work, but busy talk. Uh, yeah, definitely stay away from that. Like there's better things you could do with your time. And if this is someone that you fuck with still, or like, you know, you appreciate and all that, then try to make new memories. Like if your friend's not doing it, go ahead and, you know, try to start making new memories. Like be like, yo, let's go do this or do something maybe that's similar to whatever you guys are talking about but like present wise you feel me like don't just live in the past honestly bro now that i think about it don't even like do something regarding that like do something new like don't do the same thing twice bro that's just a waste of time um unless it gives you like some type of like adrenaline rush that you know doubles what it was the first time then okay but even then, like, just make sure you're, you're making use of your time. That's basically 
what I'm saying. And at the same time, I also want you to know that like, I want you to be around onto Anchi. I want you to be around those who are like, you know, you are building a future with um, people who are just, you're, you're, you're helping your friend be like, yo, you hear about this investment or are you investing or you know what investing is or you know what an IRA and then your friend hits you up with like, did you hear about that? This could be a cool move. This could be like profitable that are like those conversations or even like I want to travel here or let's let's get a plank instead of staying put in one place like you, 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 you know, there's a saying where it's like you gain new knowledge when you travel. So if you want to kick it with your friends, go travel and gain new knowledge together. But don't be don't stay put in the same place. Um, go get some money. Go be productive and go do that. That's what I'm saying. It's like if you're around people who are stay put, who don't want to work, who are just at home, there's a very high chance that you'll probably just be like that because that's what you're you're so used to, and you're probably gonna be so tired. Like you just get used to it. You know what I'm saying? You just don't want to get up and be active, but definitely switch that mindset around like mentality um turn that shit like a 360 and and do the opposite don't just sit around um and if you have friends that are working then great be around those people and like you know grind talk converse and think about what you guys can do with your money not right now but for like the future if that makes sense uh so that's pretty much it that i had to share with y'all i have two quotes or like not two quotes two screenshots that um Definitely go uh, one, like hand in hand with one another on uh, what I talked about, which is the first one is upgrade your standards, mindset, and most importantly, your hustle. Say that one more time. Um, upgrade your standards, mindset, and most importantly, your hustle. And lastly, your broke friends will call you to talk about people. Your wealthy friends will call you to talk about ideas. It's up to you which, which call you will answer. Or which call you, yeah, which call you'll answer. Um, and I'll say that one more time. Your broke friends will call you to talk about people. Your wealthy friends will call will call you to talk about ideas. It's up, it's up to you which call you'll answer. Um, yeah, I don't know. I kind of like, I didn't zone out, but like, I don't know. Anyways. That's pretty much it that I really wanted to share with y'all. Um, oh, I was just thinking about this is very live reaction that like you're getting a live like thought process of me right now. Anyways, um, what I was trying to like what I was thinking for a second was about that last screenshot that I was talking about. It doesn't even have to be wealthy friends. It's just friends that are productive, that like always have new ideas or something new that you want to talk about or like hit, hit, hits you up. And be like, yo, like, what do you think about this? Like those type of people you want to be around. You don't want to just be answering FaceTimes for Bob because he was at the party last night and shit happened. Like, so well, you weren't even there. So why, why would you really care enough to, you know what I'm saying? Like that could be something that y'all talk about, like for a few moments, like on, on at lunch or something. Right. But that doesn't have to be something that y'all are talking about, like over the phone and now you're probably going to spend 20 minutes just talking about it like you're not even eating you're not you know it's not face to face you get what i mean bro so um yeah decline bobs and answer answer uh amy's or answer uh or um you know matt's um call if he's you know he, he if he's always or she's already always talking about like something new like um what's the word i was about to say um fuck damn i lost it bro damn anyways i'm not gonna like edit, edit this out you're just gonna get the live reaction or like live thought process of what i'm talking about um oh gravitate that's the word gravitate towards those type of people don't gravitate towards those who talk about the same thing over or what's what's trending or what happened last night type shit um gravitate towards those who are always thinking about tomorrow thinking about some new shit um because you can always be a part of that and you can always make your you can have your own mark on it you feel me you can't really have your own mark on last night's party you can only really give your opinion and that's really a wasted opinion don't you think or a waste of time because it's not something that you really can relate to because you weren't there um 
if that makes sense. Anyways, it's your boy, Steve Hobson, and uh, I'll catch y'all tomorrow. Um, I was pretty productive today. I finally got my TV up on the wall. It's been something that I've been trying to do for like the past few months, um, but we finally did it. Um, shout out to the bro, Jacob, that helped me do that. Um, and yeah, I had a pretty productive day for the most part besides that. Um, I hope that you did too. Um, and I hope that if you're watching this video and you're starting your day, well, I hope that you have a blessed, you know, start and a great start to the day. Um, and if you're at that midday towards the end of your day, well, I also hope that you had a great day nonetheless. Um, and a great, great rest of your evening. Yeah. Anyways, it's your boy, C.O. I'm going to catch y'all tomorrow. I love y'all. Peace.